Maddie from Throne of Tisca. And everybody likes to blow up balloons, especially if you've got parties and things. So I have a different little take on this, and uh, it's, it's kind, of, uh, kind of a lot of fun, but the parents need to be involved. And so this, I guess, is really a good thing to do with parties. I did it with my child whenever he was small. So what you're gonna need is you're gonna need vinegar, and you're gonna need some baking soda, a little funnel, some balloons, and something that has a neck that you can stretch the balloon over. So you can use uh, little bottles for this. The little plastic bottles will probably be okay for this. Just might have to you know, try it first before you have the kids do it. So the first thing that we wanna do is we want to put some baking soda inside of our balloon. Now, a lot of people have done something similar to this with the volcano experiment, where you take the baking soda and the vinegar and you make that volcano. But the fun thing about this is whenever you do it with a bunch of kids and you fill up the balloons with different amounts of baking soda. So if you're you know, into doing some experimenting at home, you can have a lot of fun with this and you can do different variations. Um, and you can see just how much, you know, whether one or two or three teaspoons of the baking soda works better or, you know, a little baking soda, a lot of baking soda. And you can also uh, pull some pranks, like maybe you want to pull a prank on your dad and your mom and you want to see who can blow up the balloon fastest and then you don't put any baking soda in the one that you give your dad. Yeah, don't do that to your mom because she's the one that cooks for you. She may not cook you dinner, but you can do it for your dad. All right. So I've got some baking soda inside my balloon. Looks innocent enough. And I'm just gonna take some vinegar. And, mmm, smells nasty. Pour some vinegar in here. So you could also play around and experiment. Just how much vinegar should you put in here? You could do this five or six different times and see what is the absolute best combination of vinegar and baking soda, all right? And so what I do, I have these set up before my party or before my contest or before my prank, whatever. And they're just sitting here and then I'll say, okay, we're gonna have a balloon blowing contest. And you gotta tell the person, you're gonna stand it up. And kids love this. And you gotta blow your balloon. Oh my God. This is taking so much breath. And you want to see whose balloon is going to blow up the fastest or whose balloon is going to blow up the most. And hopefully your balloon won't pop on you. But I do hope that you have fun doing this. And I'm glad you watched. <laughs>